The circular economy is one where everything is reused and nothing is wasted. It's the antithesis of the throwaway culture, and it's about turning waste into a resource. Research from McKinsey and the Ellen McCarthy Foundation has found that it could be worth two trillion US dollars to the global economy, which is the equivalent in size of the economy of Italy or Russia. And the same source has found that it could be worth 700 billion US dollars to the consumer goods industry alone. As well as these cost savings, there are other drivers um, which are leading to the increased interest in the circular economy. And these include increased demand globally for natural resources, fears around the security of supplies of natural resources, particularly when they're concentrated in very narrow geographic areas, um, which is the case with rare earth metals in China, and also the increased demands for sustainability from both consumers and governments alike. And in fact, I would argue that we've reached a new normal of the awareness of the true value of natural resources, whatever their physical actual price. So the question is, how can companies tackle this? And the answer is in recycling, which is about turning waste into a resource. And as well as the cost savings, it also helps them to increase their reputation amongst end consumers. And a good example of a company doing this is the Sony Group with their Go Recycling program. And this is um, targeting uh, Sony to use fewer raw materials and also to increase their recycling and reuse of waste and to stop sending waste to landfill and even waste to be recycled and used by third-party companies. Sony have also created their own um, brand of recycled plastic, which is made from 99% recycled materials. And in the future, there will be an increased emphasis on end-of-life recycling with exciting opportunities for companies um, that can harness take-back schemes. Um, we already see this happening to some extent, particularly with domestic appliances and also um, with mobile phones. And in the UK, we're something of a pioneer in textiles recycling. Um, and Marks & Spencer's, a UK retailer, runs a successful shopping scheme with a charity, Oxfam. And this scheme encourages consumers to bring back items of clothing when they enter the store to purchase new goods. And Oxfam then takes these unwanted items and either recycles them, reuses them, or resells them.